the power of greed. Morgan spends a bit talking about this in chapter three of The Psychology of Money. He discusses how dangerous it is when you have a high ambition to try to get more power, more prestige, and more money. He says, and I quote, that modern capitalism is a pro at two things, generating wealth and generating envy. That is definitely true. It's so hard for us as humans in the society we live in right now to be happy with what we have. Some people more than others even struggle to not compare themselves with other people. And I highly recommend reading the book um, and looking at some of my other videos, by the way, of the first rule of mastery, stop worrying about what people think of you. If you're one of those people for some good tips on navigating through that. What I love is that Morgan breaks this down further that you will never be happy if you don't embrace a sense of enough. I love that he says, and I'll quote again, happiness, as it said, is just results minus expectations. Enough is realizing that insanable appetite for more will push you to the point of regret. And when you listen to people who share stories about overwhelming debt or emotional decisions that they made with their money, you learn that this is very true. Your ambition should never zoom by your level of satisfaction with what you have in life. Morgan also goes on to rattle off reminders of what is invaluable, such as reputation, freedom, independence, family, friends, being loved by those that you want to love you, and happiness. He advises that if you truly find value in these things and want to keep them, you will be wise in ensuring that you know when to stop taking risks. So what I'm taking from this is that you need to concretely identify, even now before you get there, of what does enough look like for you. Commit yourself to that now so that you don't end up accidentally sacrificing an invaluable situation for something as fleeting as money.